Okay, here I have uh, the Dell Inspiron Mini 9. What we're going to do today is we're going to replace the flash hard drive inside with a larger hard drive. Uh, when you buy the Mini 9, you have a selection of a 4 gig, 8 gig, or 16 gig drive. You can actually buy a 32 gig drive that's actually a faster speed than um, what you get from Dell. So we're going to replace the 4 gig drive we have in here right now with a 16 gig. So we turn it over. There's two access screws right here on the sides. We pull both of these out with the Phillips screwdriver. Small tip. And then this may seem like it's not coming up, but you just got to kind of get your fingernail under there and pop it open. It'll snap open like this. And the access plate comes off. Now you see the flash hard drive is right here. So There's two screws on the sides that we're going to pull off. They're very small screws. Make sure when you get them out that you pinch them and pull them out this way so that you don't drop them into the assembly area here because they're hard to get out sometimes if they fall under. Now, as soon as you take that off, notice that the flash drive automatically comes up on its own. You're just going to slide it straight out very easily. And we'll take our new drive. We actually purchased this on mydigitaldiscount.com. I think it was $99 for a 32 gig drive. Slide it back in, get the same screws, and put them back on the access cover. This will seat the flash drive back into place. Now we just take the plate, put it back on like this, replace the two screws, and now obviously if this is a brand new drive you're going to have to create a partition and format it using an external CD-ROM or if you're very uh, ambitious you could use a uh, a flash USB drive. But that's kind of a, a lot more ambitious project because a lot of flash drives don't boot correctly. So there you have it. Now we've got 32 gigabytes of hard disk space on our Flash Mini 9.